Our top story this lunchtime, South Korea's education ministry has unveiled strengthened measures to prevent cluster infections at the nation's schools. It will dispatch testing teams to visit schools for PCR testing and has designated the next three weeks as what they're calling a special prevention period. Kim do Yun starts us off. Amid growing concerns that South Korea is entering a fourth wave of infections, schools have seen more than 2,000 recent cases among students and teachers. In response, the Ministry of Education on Wednesday announced its plans to keep students safe. It announced that the next three weeks will be a special virus prevention period. The Ministry of Education will run an on-site inspection team to inspect all facilities under the ministry's jurisdiction, including kindergartens, elementary, middle, high schools, college and prep schools. I will be in charge of this until June. There also will be a prevention task force created for university campuses. It will be comprised of both university personnel and ministry employees, and they will work to make sure important messages and measures are communicated swiftly for campus safety. The ministry also will try out a testing team that goes from school to school conducting PCR tests for anyone that wants to receive one. Teams, comprised of three testers, will go around seeking teachers and students who wish to make sure they are not infected. This will be expanded nationwide if the trial run proves effective in Seoul. The community spread has directly affected the schools. Prevention within schools will not protect them completely from infections through communities. Schools need help from all citizens to keep them safe. The announcements come as South Korea reported 731 new cases on Wednesday. Of those, 692 were local transmissions. This is a spike of nearly 200 cases from the day before as cases returned to the 700s for the first time in a week. Kim Do-hyun, Arirang News.